get ready, get set, go. Saints of God, I'm speaking that to you, that God has called us to be risk takers and not caretakers. It's time for us to stop parking. If you look back over your life where you could have been, where you should have been, you would be so much farther ahead if you didn't park. I know that thing happened to you, the divorce you didn't plan. I know that you didn't have a problem with arguing with your brother. I know people, I talked to a sister who had an argument with her brother, a horrible argument, and about two minutes later, the brother drove to his death. And to this day she she's a victim to the brother's son because she held, she feels so guilty for her brother that the son runs over her every minute of the day. And I'm speaking to us that stuff happens in these lives, but I'm telling you that you can't park. Even in slow times, even in a time of social distancing, I'm speaking that word to you, you can't park here. Is there anyone here that felt that you've been in park, that God's calling you to another place. How can the enemy be coming in like a flood and the whole church is asleep? The whole church ain't fighting. The whole church is at home. The whole church is not resisting the devil. I'm telling you and I'm speaking this word prophetically into your life that you can't park here. My best right. I'm telling you that you can't park here. You can't park here. Stop seeing the same old people. Stop doing the same old things. Stop making the same old money. Stop being in the same old mess over and over and over again. It was 2012, you were in the same mess. It's 2015, you were in the same mess. You're going through the same thing in 2020. And I'm speaking that God wants us in Isaiah 10, verse 27. It says that it shall come to pass in that day that his burden shall be taken off of thy shoulders and his yoke from off thy neck. And the yoke shall be destroyed because of the anointing. Saints of God, I'm speaking that word into your life that you can't park here. We ain't got a whole lot of folks, but God told us not to park. God wants us to step out on faith. He wants us to come out of the garage. He wants us to put the car in gear. You got gas. You said you got faith, but you got faith and you ain't gone nowhere. It's time to start moving. It's time to start advancing. It's time to come out from that red light. God gave us a great life. He tagged me on the back on last night. And he told me I could give you a prophetic green light over your life. You can't park here. We ain't got no time to park. The devil's having a hate day. He's coming up and on, he's on his mission to steal, to kill, and to destroy. But saints of God, I still remember what the Bible says in John 10 and 10. The thief coming out of the fort is still to kill and to destroy. Jesus talking, but I've come that you might have life and you'll have that life more abundantly. Saints of God, aren't you tired of robbing Peter?
I'm telling you.